How's it going, everybody? Johnny Styles here with the Wellness Observer Live, powered by Bad Dude Co. Visit baddudeco.com. Use the code WOL15 to get your 15% off your supplements. Those type of supplements you can't find just on any random store. So go check them out. Go check out liquidsunrays.com for the very best competition tanning in our bodybuilding and fitness world and today's reaction video is going to be none other than the doctor will see you now miss sunny andrews which is kind of like an enigma and sunny andrews whether you like her or you don't like her whether you love her or you hate her she is again a magnificent athlete with a tremendous fighting spirit and not only that she continues to improve and literally prove people wrong. Sunny has come a long way, and this is a cool video she posted back when she started and kind of the evolution of her physique and how she has evolved year after year. This is going back to 2019 and, you know, now 2022. You guys have seen her. I've brought her over to the show. I've done interviews with her. She is great. She's kind of like an enigma because I guess for this prep, she kind of left social media for a little bit and stopped, you know, stopped posting updates, which is weird because by the time she was doing the Olympia last year and by the time she was doing the Arnold, she was posting, you know, updates and I could, you know, every now and then I would get an exclusive from her and I would post it right up here for you guys to see. But this time around, she, you know, I guess she concentrated more on herself, not on social media. She's been training clients and she you knows she's been focused on her coaching, but she's never stopped training. And, you know, you never know with the doctor what she's going to be doing next but one thing is, is sure from her, she looks right on the money. And this is not something that you can see her like. I've talked with other competitors. I've seen other competitors look very soft. She looks like she can step on stage like now. And it's one of those things that, you know, her proportions are so amazing for the wellness category. And I see people saying, hey, you know, her legs look big, you know, her glutes look humongous. And yes, this is what it's all about. This update from her, her quads look absolutely crazy. And her glutes are super full. Now, I was looking for Sonny's Olympia routine, but I don't have it. I guess, you know, something happened with the video. But I do have her video for when she did the and I'm going to play that for you guys, and we're going to talk about it. We're going to react to it. And I'm going to tell you, you know, maybe she can get better on some things here and the other. Again, I haven't seen this video in a while. I haven't seen the Olympia videos. Now I haven't seen the Arnold videos. But I chose to use her Arnold video because none other than, hey, we didn't have the Olympia video. So here is Sonny and the Arnold on this year. I'm going to post it on screen so you guys can see it. It's the other format, but we're going to see it right here. This walk right here, I don't like it. I don't, I don't know if you guys have followed me for a little bit, but I knew I've, I've critiqued Sunny hard for her posing. You got to realize that for her last year, you know, when she did the Olympia, she was doing the prep with John Meadows and John Meadows passed away. And that's unbelievably hard for any competitor just to lose. Um, her coach, you know, moving up to the biggest show of her career. And one thing that I did say in my in my in my star rating review on her was, you know, she she has all the muscles needed for the class. Okay, she has all the muscles needed for the class. I remember, you know, she's smaller in height, and um, she can't get too crazy, but. Amazing calves, all in the right places, shredded quads, good midsection, you know, great hams, adductors. From the back, she really pops, especially in this pose. When you see this pose from the front, it looks redonkulous. 
And, you know, it, it flows, you know. Um, her quarter turns needed to get better, and um, her upper glute needed a little bit more size, which I can assure you she has gotten right now. She has gotten better. She has gotten better, which each and every time she stepped on stage, she is one of those girls that people think, you know, she can get hard, she can get soft, you know, it, it's a happy medium she has to find. But her posing needed to needed needed some work. I, I didn't like the way she was walking on stage. I didn't like her quarter turns. Um, I've seen her harder, obviously. Now she she knows how to dial it in. I believe she's working now with George Farah, and they're gonna dial it in for this year's Olympia. And it should be interesting at the moment. I remember when I did my little preview back in June, I talked about Sunny, and she was, ladies and gentlemen, she was the only American competitor that I had in my first call out. Will that change? You'll find out soon as we draw closer to the Olympia and I will be doing my preview with my predictions. But I do believe that still at this time, Sonny Andrews is, an, uh, is a magnificent athlete to represent the class. And it's right up there with, you know, the, the best of the best athletes. This Arnold Classic was even better than how she looked at the Olympia. That shows you how much she took it seriously and how much, you know, time and effort and you know, preparation for her to look a certain way. Again, I like her look. I don't like the jumpy walk. She does tend to do that. Hopefully she's dialed it in. I know that she took it seriously and it's going to be time to show people that, you know, this package is totally worth it. I Cannot wait. At the moment, I'm not going to go crazy with predictions right now, but at the moment, at the moment, I do kind of still have her. I am not sure, but I can pull it up on screen so you guys can know before, you know, we keep doing all these cool videos on you guys. I'm going to look at the, uh, the post that I did on June 28th. This was the call out that I had set up at the moment. I had Francia Limatos, Isa Pereira, Sonny Andrews, Giselle Machado, Juju Estaseo, Ryan Fogal. In that first call out, this second call out, you know, I had an extreme woman right there. I had Julia Shitara, Bobby Manu, Angela Warren, Jarish Nayala, and Cass Gillis. Again, the stars right here, it will tell you, card subject to change. And my friends, this card will be changing one more time. <laughs> Because, again, you know, some of the girls have, you know, dwindled into placings. And now I can I can look forward. And the Nostradamus of wellness is pretty spot on with his predictions. But this is by far the hardest prediction show that I've ever, ever done. That includes the men's Olympia in all my years in the bodybuilding and fitness world. But as you saw right here, and this was in June, of 2022 this is my prediction of that first call out sunny andrews was right there in that call out so we will have to wait and see until my prediction show and the 2022 olympia which will be held back in las vegas nevada and it's gonna be one of the very best olympias yet this has been johnny styles thank you so much for following thank you so much for following on itunes spotify youtube all that jazz you know where to get the very best wellness news and updates and all the good stuff. With none other than the godfather of wellness, Johnny Styles. I'll see you very soon. And hey, we only have a few videos left before the granddaddy of them all. So stay tuned and I'll see you.